Hey, hey, everybody. Hope you're doing well today. Let's take a look just at the graph of positive externalities of consumption. And if you, if you don't have a thorough understanding of positive externalities of consumption and how they're a market failure, go see um, the previous video that talks about the whole diagram, how it's constructed, and the possible government solutions. This one's going to be short and sweet. We're going to talk about the diagram, how to construct it. Here we go. Okay, so all, con all, all um, uh, externality graphs start in the same place. And remember, this is consumption. And when you see consumption, you know that the marginal social benefit and the marginal... One of these two lines is going to shift, and we know it's consumption because this is the old demand curve. If this were production, negative or positive, then there's going to be a shift in the marginal social cost and the marginal or the marginal private cost curve, which is the old supply curve. So we're doing consumption. It's going to be positive externality. So something's going to happen to one of these two lines, the marginal social benefit or the marginal private benefit. In this case, we have the consumption of, say, health care or education is creating an external benefit, positive benefit to people around. And I like to say, if, hey, if you have good health care, if you're healthier, you know, I have, that is an external benefit to me, which is that I'm less likely to get sick because you're not coughing or sneezing or whatever. So the way that would look is that we've taken the marginal private benefit. That's, that's you, right? That stays the same at P1, Q1. But what happens is there's an additional benefit to society is the fact that you're healthier. And that means that I'm less likely to get health, that I'm less likely to get sick, or more likely to stay healthy, and, and vice versa. If I consume health care, you're less likely. And so society as a whole is going to benefit. Social benefit is going to be greater than just the private benefit. And so what you need to think about in both the externalities of consumption, production, or, um, or rather, what you need to think about here for positive externalities of consumption is the goal is Q2 consumption. The government wants to maximize and get this potential welfare gain realized. And so what they're going to do is figure out ways of getting production, of getting the consumption from Q1 out to Q2. So let's take a look at how they could do that. Here's one solution. They could very simply create a sub, very simply, they could create a subsidy which would push the marginal social cost curve outward, right, by the amount of the subsidy. And as a result of doing that, right, it's going to create a situation where Q2 is consumed, right? So they got Q1, P1, Q1 is being consumed in the marketplace. And now they want, the government though wants Q2. That's the goal. So what could they do? Well, if they subsidize healthcare, then hey, more people will be benefiting from that subsidy and healthcare consumption will go out to Q2. That is solution one, a subsidy to the healthcare providers around uh, the nation. And here is another possible solution. And you notice here that there's been a different shift. The solution two is positive advertising. What would that mean? Well, remember, the goal is Q2. And they want to figure out how to get to the socially optimal point of A here, of consumption of Q2. And so what the government can do is create an advertising campaign that would entice more people to get healthier. And then that way, as a result of the marginal private benefit curve, the private, more private people consuming healthcare, you have a chance of pushing this outward and taking advantage of this green triangle, which is potential welfare gain. And there's another solution the government could do, and these are solutions you could offer in your valuation section of your uh, paper one questions on positive externalities of consumption. All right, I hope you thought this video was helpful. We'll talk to you in a bit.